Our hearts beat to the city streets We begin to feel the fire We rise like tall buildings As the chemicals that take us higher The night's young and it's just begun As she puts her hand in mine Hello everyone, welcome back to Not Family Adventures. Uh, today is a pram unboxing and sort of review. Um, so we ordered the Mamas and Papas Akaro in Phantom and I think it's a nine-piece nine bundle we managed to get, um, which was on offer and it's currently five stops away. So just waiting for it to arrive and so excited to open it up and put it together and test it all out. Hopefully it's okay, no damages to it, and me and Chris can work out how to use it. Currently four stops away. And it's all here. There's one, two, three, four, five boxes. The bloke brought in for me, it was very nice, bless him. He asked me where I wanted it and I just said in here. And then he told me this was really heavy, so to not lift that one. Um, I'm just going to message Chris and see if he wants me to wait for him to put it together or to um, start putting it together now. We'll see what he says. He is in an event today, so he's finishing a bit later. Um, he's in Birmingham today, so it's going to take a bit longer for him to get home as well. But I'll see what he wants to do. So, mm. this is it here, the phantom colour, eye mm. size um, car seat, and then I'm not sure what's in this, probably just the extra bits and bobs, basket, Maisie's basket in there, Chrissy's back! <laughs> You know what that means? Prime time! <laughs> For me. Anyway, I'm going to open them and Chris is going to have a sit down. Yeah. <laughs> With a non alcoholic glass of Prosecco. <laughs> I'm not well, I'm No, I am. Oh. Okay, in the first box we have got the nappy changing bag. The Pushchair liner. This is the foot moth, I think. Yeah, the foot moth. And we've got the interchangeable clips. And then this must be the cup holder, yep. Cup holder in that one. You're okay there, Holmes, you're very hot. Okay, so with this bag, you get a pocket at the front, which is magnetic. And then inside the bag, which is actually quite big, you get a bottle holder and a nappy changing mat in there as well and then the zip pocket at the back and at the front for storage as well the one at the front is waterproof or it feels like it's got a liner that's protected um and then it just zips up it is quite a big bag so i might not use this one i might get a smaller one we'll see Designed to fit most push chairs, apparently. Made from 100% pure wool, breathable sheepskin fabric. Keeps baby warm in winter and cool in summer. Oh, 
This may be cooler than summer, huh? Just like what? Right, That's the soft thing. This is just opening the main pram up. I didn't think you'd be able to get the security label off. We've not nicked that knife, by the way. Um, yeah, I did buy that knife, but she forgot to take the tag off and it didn't actually set the alarm off either. It's very strong, the pliers can't get through. <laughs> so, to be out, you can still open it up and get the blades out of it anyway, so. If I couldn't, I would have got it, would have went back in there, but... <laughs> yes. Is there anything else in there? Is there? Yeah, that was something. At least it's well protected. I've chucked it all outside for now. This important part. Instructions. <laughs> Definitely smells new. Apologies for the finger that went in front of the uh, camera there.
it lines up, the pole lines up the thing, but I don't really know where it's supposed to be showing. Might be a silly suggestion, but let's try the other side. I think I'll start on the other side. <laughs> Was that? Oh no, it's in a break for the other side. So it has to be that way then. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Just brute force. <laughs> Front ones. Oh. Which way is this going? Um, I've got to think which way that's. Which side is that? That right side. Oh god. Can't tell. <laughs> Don't ask me how you open it, I ain't got three yet. <laughs> Marie? Yeah? How do you open it? <laughs> uh, <laughs> somehow. <laughs> Helpful. Like this. <laughs> This thing, that's oh, yeah, that one but now. Yeah, that's just yeah, lock it in place but you close it, ain't it? <laughs> so that's that's side. Sorry folks. Wrong. Why? I don't know. Maybe it's just because the bit's not in yet. Hmm. <laughs> what? Yeah. Trying to figure it all out. Yeah. I mean, I've got brackets. No, it's a bit silly. I'm going to use a the car seat. Right, so yeah, because you can also put that in, can't you? Yeah, that's what you need the brackets for, and the car seat. Okay. What's the handle? That's oh, it's going in. Uh, yeah. as well. Just 
still shoulder straps, just in harness, so this can be changed so it's facing the world wall, mother parent facing. So the foot off lifts up as well using these two buttons, so you can have it high, really low, low, middle. this up at the back, we've got the cover here, which goes all the way out, like so, uh, a little window here to see it's a baby, and then if you put this back, you can zip this up as well. So that just goes into here. So another zip here at the back, which is a ventilation pocket to the back. The ventilation pockets there, which you can open and close, which in summer will probably have open. So it's got a safety strap. Let's get here. Which, to be fair, everyone's been moaning about the basket, but it's not too bad. You've got a little space to put your rain cover as well. And I'm not sure about that bit. I suppose once you've got your change your bag in there, you haven't got actually a lot of room, but there's a little pocket here as well to put an item of whatever you want to put there. Got really nice texture to it as well. Really nice wheels. Right, I want to see if I can remember how to fold this up. They only show me in the shop once, so I'm going to have a little play. So I need to try and remember which did I think she fold this forward. that time. It went all the way down that time. I heard it. Just let it go. Right. That 
actually looks harder than what it was, but it's fine. It is actually heavier than I remember, not gonna lie. Um, but you can take obviously the seat off to hold it up. We won't be using this until she's older anyway, as in the main seat unit. So let's see if I can remember how you unfold it. Should be just a one flip thing from what I remember. So we've got to be taking it out there. Right, so bam. So let's see if I can remember how you take the actual seat off. Uh, I was being dumb. Let's try the Moses basket. Okay, with the carry cart Moses basket, it's really nice and comfy. Comes with the liner in here, which you zip on, thick mattress, which just simply slides in. It's a really nice texture to it. Again, soft handlebar. And then it also comes with this, which just simply, you know, fits into place nice and snug. Again, you don't have to have this on if you don't want to. It's got ventilation at the back again. Um, so this can fold up like that. There's two buttons, one here, one there, to fold it back down. So it folds all the way like that. And then obviously like so, you can have that buttoned up or not. I've not worked out the rain cover yet or the um, the foot moths, but that'd be another day. And then have it half open, or all the way open. And then it's got ventilation here. go on walks with her. <laughs> Next up is the Cloud T Ice Eyes. This came with the cart bundle uh, with the ice fix base which is currently there. Right that is the car seat pram all done all set up. Just got to put it in the car. Uh, the life pack position is very good in this because it means it can stay in it a slightly longer than usual. Um, that will be installed tomorrow and stay in the car. And then obviously she won't be using that for a while. So that can just be packed away for now. Um, and the Moses basket will go on there for when we do a, well. So I thought it might not even, well, we'll see. See what we use, end up using and for how long for, but yeah, very impressed with it so far. And lovely colour. Yeah, that's pretty much it for the unboxing of the pram. 
and just a quick review on the pram as well obviously once myself and chris gets more used to it i'll do another updated review on the pram and what we think of the pram and our likes and dislikes on it as well whether it's practical or impractical um and also the car seat as well we've put it in the car but if you guys would like a review on the car seat for that as well then just let me know in the comments below um it's got a bit of cold at the moment so just sitting here editing another video for you guys to put out um after the pram one but yeah hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing and review sorry it was a bit all over the place and the camera was a bit all over the place but it's quite hard to do when you haven't got the space to film unbox everything and record 100 whilst also setting up as well but we tried our best um so i hope you guys still enjoyed the video let me know your thoughts comments down below give it a like thumbs up don't forget to don't forget to turn that notification bell on and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye